Hello Internet to Desai, Azure Octave, and this is Let's Play Transport Tycoon Deluxe. I am Azure Octave, and when we last left off, we were in Fancy Pants Bay, looking at the ships raking in the big bucks. Okay, so yeah, these ships are going to single-handedly uh, help me get out of this horrible debt that I've put myself in, um, that I do actually gain a little bit every year on, so... So, so buttons. So, we'll leave these to this. This is the only place on the freaking planet that... There it is. Alright, new aircraft now available. Great. We squandered that. Alright. Um... Yeah, so we have this place that can accept goods. We're kind of scouring the area to see if there's any factories on the edge of Fancy Pants Bay. Um... Where is this here? All right, there's there's a factory right there. Are we dumping stuff into that factory? Kind of. Do we are these guys they're making zero goods. They're making no goods. There's no goods to be had. Well, um I believe this factory does transport does create goods, which is good. Um surprisingly enough, uh, what we can do then, um, as kind of a long-term project, is go into here and bring down some of the, uh, oh, I ran out of money. Um, we're gonna bring this down and make it into a, uh, boat area, which just jumped up because now there's water on either side of it, and it costs $53,000 to do. <laughs> um... Yes, there's the uh, monthly expenditures. So now we have to wait for that to complete. <laughs> or to get 50-some thousand dollars. Uh, and this is all going to go towards this silly little factory that's only producing 15 crates of goods. <laughs> Maybe this isn't such a good plan. Um, mm, let's see here. This place also doesn't create goods. Darn it. We're going to find a factory somewhere. Um, come on. Come on, game. Give me... What? <laughs> Apparently Winona isn't transporting enough people. They need two airports right after each other. Oh, <laughs> to have airplanes transfer from... I bet one of these will just turn around and deliver to the other airport. <laughs> we'll, we'll look at that. Let's, come on, where are they going? Where are you going? Where? What are your, what are your orders? You are destined to go to... Are you ever going to w Winona Woods? No. Okay, alright. So, so they're not <laughs> going to each other's airports. That's ridiculous. Um, here's a factory. No, that's a, that's a farm. Boogers. Ah, uh, the epic quest to find a factory. Where is the factories in this world uh, that are actually producing things? Uh, Oh, gosh, it looks like they're only up here, which makes tons of goods, uh, and then it all would have to go down to this dock down here. So I have nowhere near enough uh, money to be able to do something like that. That's too bad. So we're going to have to hold off on that. We'll we'll put little Jimmy's toy trains uh, on the shelf for right now. we got to wait until we're filthy rich, and then we can just start doing ridiculous projects in the name of... Uh, uh, <laughs> in the name of just being there and being silly. Um, we're back up to very good with our geeks in the docks, transporting them to Winona. The poor people of Winona are having this influx of freaks wandering into their cities, still in their cosplay uniforms. There's Sephiroth, uh, going to church. He's, he sits down and he kneels for a while and prays that Cloud dies. And then he gets back on the boat and goes over to his job in Dorks in the... where he works as a technical e expert in 1957, which basically amounts to, you know, working on a giant computer um, over in this building here. That's all this building is, is a giant computer um, filled with, uh, with tubes and possibly starting up the internet. Who knows? Whatever. Um, where are you going, dorks in the central? Can he get out from behind there? That sign... Nope! <laughs> what the... Oh no, there it is, okay. 
<laughs> well, you just built a road going nowhere. Um, what are you doing? You're road vehicle one. You're going to dorks in the right here. Wow, what a, what an amazing journey for your 407 passengers. <laughs> Can you imagine them just piled up <laughs> in the middle of this area? Really, Beaker Bunsen? They're really. <laughs> You're you're down to forty thousand liters of oil. Uh you're you're killing me. You're just killing me right here in the street. Look at that. Uh That's fine. We can rely on Beaker Bunsen being a, a passenger uh transport. Um yeah. Where where did Spell Compendium go? We haven't been focusing at all at Spell Compendium. Spell Compendium is got a decent amount of people. It's just this nice little Nice little town in the middle of nowhere, and we really can't turn a profit on that. So, so for now, sorry, Spell Compendium, we're we're just not going to focus on you. There's no reason to. And there's there's the majestic train called a uh, train of edible bed thought. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's that's ridiculous. Um, since we're turning such a profit on that, let's have you go into here. Um, and load you up with more animal cars, because this, this is just a crying shame. The, the poor farmer leads up all his livestock to the train, and they're just piled on top of each other. There's, there's thousands, there's 258 items of livestock, they're pooping all over the place, and it's just not done. It's just not done. Let's add two more, uh, train, uh, cars to... Our train, it's its a brand new train, it can handle it. It can march right on through, and it'll start taking care of all these animals that are just lying in droves in the train station. Why are there no passengers? Because there's too many cows in the way, and there's too many cows. Alright, there is there is a power station. Do we have any coal? Can, can I get some coal in this general area? Is there any kind of coal? No. No. No, there's some coal way over here that isn't occupied yet. And what what is this? Ah, Cheston Airport. Wow, you you just managed to Well, look at that. Um Well, there's there's a possibility to expand a little bit. Um I always like trying to build up these tiny cities cuz they they're tiny. They they need some little tender love and care here. Uh, poor, there's only 270 people in Chumborn, which is a s ridiculous name. That, that, that's awful. We're, you're no longer going to be Chumborn. You're actually Chumba Wumba. <laughs> Chumba Wumba. Um, the, the, the proud people of Chumba Wumba. And you could use some kind of, uh, transportation company to help you with, with Winona. The, there's there's grandma in Chumbawamba, and her her children have taken the time to walk down to the end of the street and immigrate through the forest, fighting off wolves, um, get, crossing the forbidden train tracks of uh, the Choo Choo Transport Geek Queen, um, and made their way to live in Winona and they they don't know how to get back. They've they've forgotten their way back. It was it was kind of a surprise immigration in 1957 that they just kind of wandered off and and weren't he heard from until now, until the good people of Package Stomper Transport have taken it upon themselves to uh to build a highway straight out into Chumbawamba. So let's do it. Let's Let's make this happen. Let's do this. Um, I'm one of the problems that comes up with uh, Transport Tycoon is there are disasters as uh, trains interact with cars, um, and so one way to get around that is to straight up build a bridge. Build a build a bridge and get over it. So if you start with a bridge right here and you end right here, you can ignore the fact that these two intersect here and just make the Golden Gate Bridge here. Um, and that way you can actually get around having that hazard happen. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> that plane is like, okay, all right, whatever. So we've, we've built a bridge. Um, it's our bridge. And we're carving up the landscape, all in the name of transporting people and getting Grandma, her, her children back 
into goods with the family. Um, <laughs> livestock production at your face farm goes down by 10%. Um, which is great because that's just in time for our uh, train, which we just expanded out, to have more... Uh, more more livestock cars uh yeah that's that's perfect that's just what we wanted thank you thank you so much um what we're gonna do now is we're gonna make a bus station right here right in the middle of chumbawamba if you get in the middle of the city that usually helps uh with your ability to serve the customer uh yeah so that's that's the that's the big goal there. Uh, except if you are like me and you only want to have one station in the middle of the city, or make it the middle of the city as you make it more attractive, line the streets with gold, um, and offer free free kittens to anybody who wants to come in and use Winona Docks. Uh, that'll help get the uh, Johnson family back back in touch with Grandma. So, um. We're going to make a new vehicle here, Regal Bus. It'll be so regal, and now the grain production goes down. Ah, ah, whatever game, whatever. Um, we're going to make the Regal Bus here. We're going to buy a vehicle. We're going to buy two vehicles. We're going to go, we're going to tell this one to go to Grandma's house in Chumbawamba um, and get a full load of any cargo and then head back to Winona Docks because Winona Docks has six passengers, literally. There's, there's no reason for there to be that many buses going there and filling up because that's 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 that, that, that's a uh boat depot. We don't we don't need boats. Don't need them at all. Um go to Chumbawamba, uh full load, you two head out. That's that's how that's gonna happen. Um for, <laughs> for citizen celebrate dot 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 first bus arrives at Chumba. <laughs> they they reluctantly <laughs> accept the fact that uh, that they're they're getting their buses. They're like, ah, or that they've they've gotten a rename uh, of Chumbawamba. They were proud people of whatever the heck place it was, and now they're Chumbawambians. <laughs> um. So yeah. Um. This is the folly of connecting uh, cities together because sometimes your competitor is just going to swoop in and uh make make use of the roads that you so painstakingly put together. Like, right now, I bet uh, the people, the business of no cab is looking at their airports and saying, ah, oh, I bet we could use some bus stops here, and then they'll they'll use our, uh, they'll use our road that we put together to go over the top of Choo Choo uh, transport, and that that's how that'll work there. But this... Oh, wow, the the business of Pathzilla number two uh, is ridiculous. They've they've put together a road that will go crazy crazy across the country just to get to Ch Chenston, Chenston, those jerks in Chenston. Um, and everybody's put down an airport here. That's 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 kind of crazy. <laughs> you don't need <laughs> Chenston Central, Chenston Airport, Chenston Woods. Wasn't wasn't one of the airplanes delivering to Chenston Woods? Look at this! Look at this! There's so many vehicle jump to order three when vehicle age is. Wow, that's that's pretty complex there. I don't know if I can keep up with that guy. My orders aren't that complex. <laughs> um, we're gonna we're gonna toast one of these because it's taking forever for Chumbawambians to get on the bus, figure out that they need really. <laughs> Oh, no, that's that's that, that's fine. I don't. Th this one isn't such a big deal. We're, we've managed to keep up pretty good with this. Let's check out our other uh, bed <laughs> wheat-based bed economy. Where did that go? Where is that? Where where did it go? Who's where? Where are we? Where's our color? Here it is. This is this is us right here. And it, oh, looks like the uh, your face. Uh, bandwagon has been beefed up, and you know what we're gonna do? We're we're gonna play hardball with these guys. We're gonna say, nope, you don't get a road right there because that's our road. If you want to go there, you're gonna have to use the uh, you're gonna have to build it yourself. Sorry, enough out of you. 
we're destroying your road, we're destroying your business, and then you'll have to be the ones to maintain it. <laughs> and you can't even go back to your place. We're just going to destroy all the roads so that you have your two trucks that are abandoned. Completely abandoned trucks. <laughs> yeah. And so they're going to be left there, the poor drivers, <laughs> just stuck going around in a freaking carousel. Take that. Take that, uh, Pathzilla number two. We've declared ward. We've dropped the gauntlet. There's no way you can possibly recover from this, except if you decide to build a road, which would recover you from that. Um, <laughs> so, so yeah. Here, here's the first bus. It made a thousand fifty-five dollars. Now, 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 uh, Bob, Bob Johnson has taken the bus. He's one of the uh, two passengers from Winona Docks. That's that's taken the bus, and he's he's finally going to see Grandma. Grandma is so holy. Hannah, look at the money that we made as I sit here rambling. <laughs> Um, well, let's, let's try to actualize our dream finally. Um, let's whip out the, the terrain tool, drop that down, and we can start a more complicated, uh, uh, set of, uh, orders to take goods from Dracula, <laughs> Dracula train station full of vampires, um, and take it over to the dorks who just love vampires so much that they they can't even stand it. So, um, yeah, let's see what I'm at here. Um, we're at 16 minutes. Um, that's enough out of me for right now. The next video, we will make a more complicated uh, set of transfers to do uh, to get our toys from plastic toys from Dracula uh, over to the dorks in the docks and pray that the winds don't change and that the 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 dorks in the uh the city of dorks in the doesn't uh stop being able to accept goods in this area and that's yeah that that's for next video here so i'm as your octave um hope you're enjoying the series make sure you're liking and favoriting and all that jazz and stuff if you like it so we will catch you next time beep beep